In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create a floral text effect on Canva. So we can start by changing the color of the canvas to whatever suits our needs. Then once you find the color change that or the color scheme that you want to use, then we can add the flowers. To do this, go to elements and under elements, search for flowers, then select the option graphics. This will show us every single flower graphic that we have available on Canva, including the ones that are available in Canva Pro. So select the flower graphic that you want to use. Uh, so you just scroll through the various options and select the one that suits your needs. Then click on it to add it to your canvas. Once it's been added, you can now adjust it to however you'd like. You can even scale it up or scale it down according to your preferences. Then from here, you can now add the text. So ensure that the flowers go underneath the text. So flowers, then go to text, add text, and let's give it a, a whatever it is you want to write there. Then you can scale the text up and move it around and place it on top of the flowers in the exact position you want the flowers to be when you're creating your effect. So it can be something like this, or it can be something like that. It's up to you. And then once you're done with that, you can also choose to change the font of the uh, text. So you can use some of these fonts that are available to you on Canva. So you can also choose these uh, calligraphy fonts. It's up to you. So then once you've selected a font, the next step is to change the font color. So choose something that will stand out against the flowers. So you can leave it in black or you can change to white. Or you can even use a different solid color. You have loads of them at your disposal. Then once you're done with that, click on your graphic and then duplicate it and ensure that it's aligned with the one at the bottom. And then now you can start adjusting. So use these handles to move to crop the effect to your perfect uh, positioning and then you can keep doing these same steps until you find the perfect until you create your perfect typography so keep adjusting and then you'll notice that as you move along the text effect is up coming out nicely so depending on what flowers you choose to use, the effect will look different compared to mine. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.